A live look outside over our beautiful state this morning as the sun comes up. Here's one of the most gorgeous spots we have. Rocky Mountain National Park in Long's Peak. Just majestic this morning. Crystal clear skies. Now we are dealing with a little more cloud coverage this morning as the sun comes up from our lookout mountain camera here over the Denver metro area. But sun will be shining through midday and temperatures will top out near 80 degrees. It is a bit of a cooler morning out there at DIA 54 degrees. Winds relatively calm though sustained from the east northeast just at five miles per hour. Very quiet. Quiet conditions across the state. We had a cool front roll through yesterday. It brought some very gusty winds and cloud coverage, but today that's exiting the state and we'll see some warmer temperatures settling in. Right now, though, we're still in the 50s from Firestone to Erie down through Castle Rock. Commerce City right now only at 51 degrees and only in the upper 30s over portions of our northern front range mountain towns. You can see from our metro area planner, partly cloudy skies over the next couple of hours, but by 9 a.m., mostly sunny and 63, 11 o'clock, 68 degrees and daytime highs still about 5 to 10 degrees below average for this time in August. Typically, Denver averages a high of 88 this time of the year. We're in the high 70s, Englewood through the Montclair neighborhood up into Congress Park, but further west into the mountains, it's going to be another pretty warm day. It'll actually be warmer places like Steamboat Springs, Eagle and Vail than it will be Denver north and east for this afternoon and hot out west in Grand Junction at 96 degrees. We will see the chance for a few scattered thunderstorms and showers, mainly over the far th southwestern corner of Colorado. Here's what it looks like as we go through future cast sunny skies over the eastern plains through midday and then down south near Durango and Pagosa Springs and Telluride could be picking up a few scattered showers and isolated storm or two risk of any severe weather though will remain low. Then tonight into early tomorrow morning any moisture will taper off partly to mostly cloudy skies from Colorado Springs down to the border but through the day tomorrow it's going to be sunshine once again and daytime highs will be toastier that summertime heat building back in across the state it'll bring us back to the 90s here for much of the front range and plains. Tomorrow afternoon, another round of thunderstorms possible from the western slope down across the southwestern corner of the state. But overall here for the Denver area and eastern plains, it is going to be a dry next several days. Tomorrow it'll also be hotter. You can see by noon at 82 degrees with daytime highs set to top out in the low 90s. That also includes Colorado Springs up through Fort Collins and Greeley. High 80s to low 90s across the plains. A warmer than average weather pattern expected here for much of the Denver area area and east as we go through the next 10 days or so and you can see that on our super seven day forecast low to mid 90s through the end of the week and upper 80s with mostly sunny skies and dry conditions expected this weekend.